All right, y'all, so Lily just dropped, and yeah, I snagged the HD video, and let's do a quick little reaction and insights video as far as from a Yoshi perspective, right? Because her main problem, like in all previous games, is like she, her tracking was so bad, and oh my god, there's a cat. Salt. Salt the cat. Oof, okay. Well, her redesign looked good. She's not as angular as she is in Tekken 7, the fighting era. It's a cool outfit. It's very moody like stuff. Yo, her, her quads are thick. Dang, girl. She got thick. Okay, that is a very fast move. New back turn extension. The 1-1. One, one. And then back 2-1, the looks of it. Oh, yeah, the power crush out of the back one uh, crouch cancel. Yeah, her model looks so much better. Holy crap. And look, character development. Something that this game needed for ages. Yo, Asuka animation is back on Lyft. That was in Tekken 7, like, very, very, very early. And then they took it out for some reason. Yeah, that's the heat burst. That heat engager. Double spin. Interesting. Wonder what she gets out of it. Like as far as new moves. Yo, that is a Manon move. Like super Manon move. If you haven't seen Street Fighter VI stuff, like Manon is a very, very similar to Lily. Actually, very dancerly, but she's a grappler, a grappler dancer. So she's sharing a lot of animation. <laughs> Yo, that little Sammy's cat. That's pretty cool. I can buy it. That is pretty cool. Okay, so overall, she translated pretty well from the looks of it. Um, yeah, so let me do a quick little breakdown of the individual sections. Let me chop this up really quick. Alright, so in this beginning section, that looks like a potential heat engager by the looks of it. Yeah, that purple mist. Yeah, it looks like a 1 1. That leads into the back turn, right? So let's do it again. New move. The engaging move by the looks of it. And one. Three. And then he mashed and got counter hit stun. And she falls. Okay, here. Back three. Does that instantly go into the little dance thing? The little spin? Oh, maybe. It looks like it. And then the low. While standing one. Counter hit. And she gets a full forward two. Nothing really changed there. Alright, here. Hop kick. She goes pretty far forward. Alright. So it looks like hop kick, right? One, one, back turned, back turned one, two, or one, one maybe again, and down two, two, three. Okay, pretty standard, I, th I think there, right? Let me do it again. Okay. Back turn one, two. Yeah, it looks like back turn one, two, and then down. Two. Okay. Now this part looks like a pretty good buff. She. Or after the back one, you pretty much could mash or just do a defensive option and she had to take it. But with that power crush there, that wall splats, she gets chunky damage by the looks of it. Could be a non thing later on, but like, because it's like splat and then re splat and then her standard wall ender. Alright, so now here's the interesting part, right? So they re-added Asuka's whip animation on the forward forward one, right? Let's do those quick slow really quick. Like, she is heavy minus. <laughs> she... Oh, and look. Wow, the health sweep gives an instant tailspin animation on hit. And that could be potentially a nerf as far as damage output for her goes. Alright, this section. I have no idea if that move is a low or not. So, 3 plus 4, back turn. It looks like she slaps you. So it's like a special mid or back turn mid. It's, it's, uh, 3 plus 4, or down forward 3, 3 plus 4. Yeah, it looks like a back turn down punch. That thing is very fast. Here, spin, heat and gear here. That came out so fast. So, back four, into the mid punch, heat engager. Oh, that's that new move. 
So it's a two kicks into a double backflip. Okay, let's look at the slow motion again. The engager. The new input of that move. Kick, kick. Back turn. Three plus four and it spikes. Here's, and now here's a glimpse of like... Okay, so he engaged on three, two. Double spin, but they don't show much. And with a new wall standing move. Okay, so three, one. Runs in. Up forward. Four. And then double spin into this cool ass wall standing kick. Again in slow mo again. Okay. So he engager. Three double spin into a low bat that looks like it home. Is it home or it has some type of particle effect on it? Interesting. And then this sequence is just crazy. So slow mo, right? So three. All standing one two. No wait, that's all standing two one. Alright. Or one one. No, it's one one, so new kick. Oh my god, that, that, that is so manon, it's insane. Okay, so three. All standing one one. Heat engage your bounce now. So it's a combo starter in heat. Whatever that new kick into that ballerina pure pirouette. I don't know how to say it. Yo, so she has two crouch cancels. Okay, while standing on one is now a launcher in heat. So does the heat run? It looks like it's a full crouch kick. Oh, so she can do down back one into the crouch dash into the four four four. Interesting. And her rage art looks very similar to Manon's rage art. It's pretty funny. Ends in a flash kick. Overall, it's pretty cool. It looks like she made the transition very well over into the new engine. Um, personality definitely is there. Character building is there with Asuka. Looks pretty cool, actually. Cannot lie.